You are always being watched by security cameras. However, you can actually become invisible with this one easy exploit. Hello fellow engineers, I'm Dave Nordman. Today I would like to show you how you can fool IR night vision security cameras by using a powerful yet invisible IR light source. And for all you scum of the earth would-be criminals out there, get out, intellectuals only. This is for scientific demonstration only, so don't go getting yourself into any trouble. Do you remember when I used to make my videos with this garbage camera? Well, it has one redeeming quality, which is that it has a night vision setting, and I can use this to simulate my security camera. It makes sense for security cameras to use an IR night vision setting because otherwise you would need to constantly illuminate an area and it would make the location of the cameras extremely obvious. However, switching to an IR source means that you could potentially bathe the entire area in IR light and nobody would even be able to see it since our eyes have a very limited range of response to color. Now let's say you're in town, just, you know, being a good citizen, except it's nighttime, and you get to thinking, hmm, I would like to be incognito to security cameras, but I don't want to stick out like a sore thumb. So what you can do is you can put on a hat or a hood with an IR LED strap to it, which looks invisible to anybody in your vicinity, however, to IR cameras, looks like this. Now, just to recap, when there is an intense LED source somewhere in the vicinity of your face, the intense light will create such a glare that it will obscure all of your features from the camera. And since it's in a range outside of our normal visible spectrum, most people won't even know that you're essentially a walking lens glare. In order to demo this, I purchased some IR LED chips. The wavelength of the one on your left is 840 nanometers, and the one on the right is 950 nanometers. Each are 10 watts, and I got two different values to see which one responds better to my particular camera. As you may or may not be able to see from my camera, the IR LED is almost invisible except for a very faint red glow. While it may look nearly invisible to you and me, if we put a camera in front of it that can pick up the light in these ranges, it's not that invisible after all. Alright, so here I have each of my LEDs on their own power source, and I'm going to go ahead and turn both of these on. They're both set at 5 volts. Now, it's a little hard to uh, tell which LED is the brightest without a IR camera that can tell. And it looks like the one on the left is a lot brighter than the one on the right. Alright, I know I look a little silly, but remember, this is just for demonstration purposes. Alright, let's give this a try. On. Off. On. Off. On. Off. So, right now you're looking at me from an IR point of view. This is the kind of point of view that a night vision security camera would have. And as you can see, my face is somewhat visible. However, I want to be completely incognito. Let's turn on the 10 watt IR LED. Uh oh! Where'd I go? As you should be able to see on the camera, my face is not entirely drowned out, but pretty well concealed, to the point where it's virtually impossible to make out any defining features about my face, even when I look around a little bit. Hi mom, hi dad. Now that you know how to hide from security cameras, I have a question for you. What would you do if you could be invisible? I'm just curious.
While you're down in the comments section, please consider subscribing to my channel for more weekly projects. Thanks for watching.